Hi, my name is Desmond Lee, and I'm a program manager on the Windows Fundamentals team. Today, we're going to take a look at how PCs can be recovered using the refresh and reset features in Windows 8. The first feature we're going to look at is reset. If I'm having problems with my PC and want to start over from scratch, or if I'm planning to give it away, I can reset the PC and take it back to factory condition. If I have sensitive personal data on the PC, I can also choose to erase my data cleanly so that they can't be recovered by others easily. On the other hand, if data security isn't a concern, I can instead choose the option to just perform a quick format on the drive. The process takes a couple of minutes, and the software will be back to the way it was when I've powered on the PC for the very first time. In most cases, if I'm trying to fix my PC, I'm not going to want to lose my data. And this is when I'm going to refresh my PC instead. This will reinstall Windows, but keep my personal files, user accounts, Metro-style apps, and important settings. The whole process takes just a few minutes and can be pretty handy when helping others with their PCs, especially since it doesn't require backing up all the data to another drive first and then putting them back later. As we can see here, all my Metro style apps are preserved. And you can also see that my data are here as well. Now, when I get a new PC, one of the first things I usually do is to install all the desktop apps that I use regularly. But if I refresh my PC, I would have to reinstall them afterwards. Windows 8 actually comes with a utility that lets me create a baseline recovery image of the PC so that when I refresh it, I won't have to spend hours reinstalling all those desktop apps again. All these features we just looked at are available in the Windows Developer Preview, and we can't wait for you to try them out yourselves. Thank you for watching.